Hi, I'm Joe Vergera from Mr. Bianca and Q. This is ChefMasterclasses.com and I'm very excited to present this uh, wonderful dish that I grew up with. It's called bracciole. It's eye fillet, roasted, uh, with crusted with breadcrumbs and, uh, and parmesan. Eye fillet, cleaned, and then we portion it into about 80 gram slices. We place them on some glad wrap. So what we have to do is flatten them nice and thin so then we can actually roll them. So glad wrap back on top. So to get it nice and thin we use a mallet. But obviously this is not a mallet, it's uh, something that we're kind of improvising today. First thing is we add some, some of the prosciutto. Now the prosciutto acts like a barrier in between so it protects the filling from coming out or oozing out. You can also add maybe pancetta or some copracollo or something that uh, obviously that will add some extra flavour to your, to your rolled meat. So the cheese on, so it's grated parmesan and this will act like the, the glue to hold everything, hold everything in. Breadcrumbs to stabilise it, some currants, add some sweetness and a few pine nuts. The interesting part is that we need to roll it. So once we roll it, the seams of each piece of meat need to butt in with each other. So roll it again and butt in with each other. Per portion usually is about three, three per portion. Skewer inside and just trim the ends off. So with all the trimmings, what you can do is basically mince it or chop it up very finely and make like a, a ragu or something that with a, like a bolognese or so on. So don't, don't waste them. The next, next part is adding the crust. Now this is very important. So we need to press, press hard down into the mixture of breadcrumbs and the parmesan. And so what you try to do is activate the actual meat so the salts in the, in the parmesan will react with the meat and create a crust. And this one you allow for about 10 minutes just to settle down. Okay, so after 10 minutes we're taking them out of the oven. Our little masterpieces. If you could actually feel this, it's actually crunchy. Place it on the, on the bed. And our vegetables that we, it's a very traditional caponata. So it's just basically grilled vegetables, uh, oven roasted tomatoes, onions and capers, and a few pine nuts and currants. Onto the plate. Make sure, don't touch the skewer. It is very, very hot. If you have a, a sauce, this is just a very simple red wine sauce, we can just pour it over the top. This is my beautiful bracciole with caponata, capers and pine nuts. I hope you enjoy it.